Hello, I'm Dave Corbassier. Right now on your 13 Action News Update, police are investigating a murder on Charleston and Decatur. Uh, we're told that two men got into a disagreement outside a drugstore. Uh, police say the shooter was in the car, the victim was leaning into the window, and at some point the shooter drove off while the victim was still stuck in the window. That person was able to get free and run away, but then he tripped on a median. And police say that's when the shooter got out of his car and opened fire. Officers are calling this a brazen crime at a busy intersection. They're asking anyone with information to come forward. A silver and black did not have any picks in the NFL draft on Thursday, but they will be on the clock on Friday. Their first selection will be the 22nd pick in the third round. Then they have the 21st pick in the fourth round. The Raiders have two selections in the fifth. The first coming up in the 21st spot and then the 22nd. And lastly, the silver and black will pick in the seventh round with the number six pick. You can watch the NFL on Channel 13. Danny. Wind speeds calm down tomorrow gusts right around 25 miles per hour, so you're still going to notice a bit of a breeze. It's just not nearly as strong as what we felt on Thursday. Temperatures about the same. We'll wake up to upper 50s, low 60s with highs capped to the low 80s. It's near normal for this time of year with a whole lot of sunshine. Moving into Saturday and Sunday, highs climb closer to 90 as the sunny skies stick around. We will get a bit of a breeze picking back up Sunday into the start of next week, but it doesn't do much to temperatures. Looks like we are sticking in the uh, upper 80s, low 90s through the next seven days with sunshine and mostly dry conditions expected as well. That was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.